Rick B's Daily Vlogs. In the Dolores Park neighborhood, Dolores Park is up the street right there because back in 1906, during the major earthquake when everything was on fire and everything decided to give up, there's something that kept going and kept this district from flames. Let's go down there, let's go check this out. Let's get this started. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Welcome everyone, it's my daily vlog channel, Eric B's Daily Vlogs. I'm walking down the hill, because at the bottom of the hill, a little something that, again, I stated earlier that is the only fu functional thing during the 1906 earthquake. I've been trying to hit this spot for the longest time, but it's always been hard. And now with the whole protest, Dolores Park is a big gathering for a lot of people. But we're headed down there. Well, let's go check this out. You see that? I'm walking down the hill. So that means at the end of the video, I got to walk back up. Didn't think this through, but we're headed there right now. So let's go check this out. Let's go. Let's go. With Dolores Park in the distance and the old mission, Mission High School now, during the 1906 earthquake, this whole area was up in flames and every fire hydrant in this area failed except for one. The golden fire hydrant nicknamed the little giant this is the only fire hydrant that actually survived the 1906 earthquake giving water to this mission area neighborhood and if you guys go back into your history books and you see and read about the 1906 earthquake it just devastated a lot a lot of parts of San Francisco. Now the houses don't look the way it does right now. These houses definitely look more modern, but just imagine this was the only fire hydrant working during that earthquake. 114 years. This right here is still still going. Now you guys remember when I was at my when I did my firehouse museum, there's a bunch of these little old type fire hydrants that was around there. 114 years. They never removed it. They never changed it. They would come in every year, every anniversary of the 1906 earthquake, and they would give it a fresh coat of spray paint, which is kind of cool because, again, if this wasn't around, everything around us was probably up in flames. You guys know how I feel about people who likes to graffiti. This person right here does not know the significant history that this fire hydrant had to this city. Again, if we pan around and we look, right there, Mission Dolores, Dolores Park, the Mission neighborhood, all up here all saved because of this fire hydrant. Now, if you go back to elementary school, for us who went to San Francisco school out here, do you guys remember a story? Remember the little engine that could? Talked about a train, I was going up a hill, and it kept saying, yes I can, yes I can, yes I can. There's actually a story here in San Francisco about this fire hydrant. Same thing, it's a kid's story, and it says the same exact thing. While all the fire hydrants here in San Francisco gave up and was not functional, this one was the only one that was. And if you look across the street, over there, there's another fire hydrant over there. But this one lasted and again saved this neighborhood. 
Now right next to it there is a placard and it does state that on April 18th, 1906, yet from this Greenberg hydrant allowed the firemen to save the Mission District dedicated to Chief Dennis Sullivan. Pretty cool, a little placard and it was dedicated April 18th, 1966. Right next to this fire hydrant. That's a cool piece of San Francisco history right here, right in front of us. I always try to tell people, know your history. Know the city you live in. Know exactly what your city is for and what it did. And I do remember back in elementary school of that story, revised story, of the little fire hydrant that could. And again, it's the same story as the little engine that could, but a San Francisco author decided to write it as the little fire hydrant that could. And again, it's still here after all these years. And you got the beautiful background of San Francisco right there. I definitely like going around and showing you guys history of San Francisco, parts of San Francisco that you know you probably didn't know was here. A lot of people in this neighborhood knows this is here. A lot of San Franciscans know this is here. Every year during the celebration of the 1906 earthquake, they talk about this hydrant right here and Lana's Fountain over in, the, in Market because those were the two hydrants, fountains that was actually working during the 1906 earthquake. So to have something like this still here, 114 years, 114 years and this is still in front of me right there how cool is that how cool is that 114 years and it's still here one last look the golden fire hydrant the little fire hydrant that could the little giant the nickname that they gave it right here on church not sure what this cross street is but it's still here. After 114 years, it's still here. And it's still functional. So how cool is that? After 114 years, it is still functional. All right, guys, 799. That's today's vlog, 799. And I decided to bring you a piece of San Francisco history that's been here 114 years, served this community well, still continues to serve this community, but being that everything's a lot better now when, when it comes to fires, the fire response team are a lot faster. Unless something like a 1906 earthquake happens again, this little guy has nothing to worry about. Nothing, nothing. I wanna thank everyone who sent me a video a shout out for 800 vlogs that's going to be coming up tomorrow. 800, yes. I want to thank you guys for participating. Thank you guys for putting that together and taking time off your busy schedule to send me a video. You guys will see yourselves in tomorrow's vlog. You will. Thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me comments down below. 800 coming up. 799 right now is in the books. Here from the Golden Fire Hydrant in San Francisco on the corner of 20th and Church. Thanks for watching, guys. Vlog's ended. Go in peace. this fire hydrant just has a beautiful view backdrop San Francisco right there I want to say perfect movie location right here and I'm sure it's been done before I'm sure it has but how cool is that view right there I made this